Hello, my name's Matt. And my name's Jordan. And welcome to RuneScape and Minecraft Members Update 9, which is Nine. all of Karamja. You may see a bit of it over there, but we'll get to that. The members area of Karamja, so the members like area, a place yeah. like Brimhaven and something village. Uh, uh, I think it's Shiloh Village. Shiloh I'm, Village. I'm not it too does sure. sound right. Shiloh yeah. Village. But first of all, this is the free to play area, as a lot of you will know. We didn't realise that the buildings were as terrible as we they were. We made this eight months ago in eight March, if you ago. check up on our videos. Karamja That's was eight really, months. really long ago. That's like a lot. That's like a lot of time. Right, yeah, that's nearly like half. That's more than over it's half too... our channel ago. Yeah, Jesus. Yeah, I never even thought of it like that. Exactly. Mental. But we got to Karamja by that time. So basically, we are going to revamp Karamja, Falador, Varrock. Is there anywhere else? Uh, probably. I don't know, actually. <laughs> probably. It'll be bits yeah, in between. Falador definitely needs it. Yeah. Uh, Karamja definitely needs it. The coastline of everywhere needs it. And mm. Varrock, we believe, needs it because it's the centre of the hub. So we've not yeah. been on the server for uh, ages because, one, it's not been updated. The reason it's not is because we've been building so many projects. We've been doing it on George server and yeah, all the projects, but we've been building on George server, so that's why I sort of rim sort of took a break. It didn't really because we had Al Qarid going, but that's because we had that already saved, so... Indeed. Also, the the Predator map and also... Um, the things for Christmas that are going to come, you're going to yep. probably love those, hopefully. Well, hopefully. I can't say you're going to love them, but we hope Please. Love them. But, yeah. Please love us. <laughs> so we're getting <laughs> so to the video. Been, yeah, yeah, this is where Brimhaven's going to be. That's why there's no trees here. Uh, we decided to do the trees differently this time because it is a jungle, but it's also a thick jungle as well. Uh, the Minecraft jungles are pretty thick, and we like the idea of having bushes on the floor. So, you know, we tried to mimic Minecraft in that, in sort of we that respect. We did that with... Um, and put those on as well. We did that with our League of Legends project, didn't we? The Yes, possible. we did. So, yeah. Yeah. That, uh, so, bushes here, bushes every now and again, small little trees. So, this is where Brimhaven's going to be. Pokemon as well. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I completely forgot about that. So, over here... Um, we weren't entirely sure what was there because we've not actually got a member's account to go looking, so just a really dense jungle. At the moment, it'll probably change if there's something in-game. Well, yeah, true. We'll, we'll, we will put it in, but... Because we I don't just... have a member's account at the moment, and, you know... It's yeah, well, yeah. And also, as well, it looks nice. Like, going through these as well, and it's, like, really dark and stuff. It feels dangerous, and there's shrooms and stuff. It looks... Yeah, because really on nice. the actual game, I've been here on in RuneScape, and there are... Uh, jungle spiders that poison you and things. Oh, so, so, so to be honest, just... that I mean the, the the idea of danger. This is a pretty dangerous place in, in terms of poison and things. Yeah. So, so I've just come back into the clearing where Brimhaven was, and then coming down here, this is where it links onto the actual members' island. I think it's around there. There we go. Yes. So there is a this... little shack somewhere here, Matt. That uh, yeah, we got a bit lazy machetes. with the voxling here. By we, I mean me. I just went over hyper quick. Said I'll fix it later. Never got around to it. I'm so. deaf. I'm, I'll touch it up by hand because when Matt voxels, sometimes I get really pissed off of him. <laughs> so uh, we'll he does like one box and stuff, so yeah. it's fine. Don't worry. Yeah, and we were also practicing our <laughs> coastlines here, so sort of it fades into grass, sort of fades out again like that. Like the ones, except for there, but the ones around um, the free to play looked absolutely terrible. But we sort of wanted to do Karamja, like we stopped doing. Oh, Jordan's glowstone over there, get rid of that as well. You can do oh. that while I fly around. Oh, hell no, I'll do that while you keep talking. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So. We we wanted to do Karamja mainly because there weren't there wasn't actually that many settlements. There's Brimhaven there, then there's I think it's like Shiloh Village or something like that. Yeah, because we moved away from Sears Village at the moment, haven't we? Yeah, we've not finished that yet. But we've not <laughs> finished Sears Village or do we, what was the other place we were going to do? Um, oh, that I, was Varrock. Sorry. Yeah, yeah Varrock. Yeah. So this beach looks really nice. I just since there wasn't much stuff here, we could just go ape with the Voxling and make well, it really the thing nice. is with the Voxling here is that you remember. If you watched our World of Warcraft um, flyover of that project, we said we wanted more rolling hills. Yeah. And then also in the Al Qarid Desert, I started to do more rolling hills there. So we sort of want to make everything roll and just flow better. Yeah. So that's what we've attempted to do. I mean, with... a lot of you, for some reason, say you don't like hills. That is the minority, though. We think a lot more people like yeah. it. But this is still flat, if you look here. This is, this is a clearing. This is what I like. This isn't going to be built on. Or maybe like have the odd shack or two, but it looks so big and so expansive. It looks like it does feel yeah. like you're in a massive jungle. But it's and not like it's been generated by Minecraft at the same yeah, time. No, it's like it's, it's been built with, but it has been built by people. But what yeah. I mean is, is, it feels like a Minecraft server has actually been made, you know, rather yeah. than just generated. 
I mean, it does feel like you get lost in here. Maybe even like just having a path through the middle of it, just so you have a path to go through. I think, oh, let's see where this yeah. goes, and because this is really, really cool. But this like is this. this is massive. Like this is almost is it the size of Freljord? No, because oh, Freljord is not... the size of Runecraft, isn't it? This is the size of Varrock and its surroundings, the island. So it is pretty. It's damn just massive. taken me and Matt have just been voxeling like bastards and stuff. Yeah, and so it's this taken a the... long time to make it. This was one of the this was the mine, I'm assuming, because it was grey on the yeah. map. So. But we really want to give you um something good for Christmas. Merry yeah. Christmas. Oh. Okay. <laughs> this is coming into <laughs> this is going up tonight, isn't this... it? Um, 29th. Yeah, yeah, it is going up tonight. This is the 29th for us, which may be the 30th for you, you if guys. You're if you're Australia. in the US and oh yeah, Australia. Or Australia, and your time is the wrong time because it's eight. Yeah, it's the wrong time because it's not British time. GMT exactly. Yeah. It's one. But you know, <laughs> so yeah. here's something. Something's going to be built here. Apparently, this is Shiloh time. Village. Yeah, you'll notice it's square shaped where it is. It's it's hilly everywhere around. It's hilly, but you can still tell that it is fairly flat. But also, not too we'll flat. probably reduce it because it seems a bit too high in certain areas. Or we well, can just we'll have adapt. To see what the building's like. I mean, if there's only yeah, yeah, like exactly. one building every now and again, I think it would be cool. And then there's this bit at the very end, the very southern part of Alcarid, Al Karamja. Um, I say we pox a little bit more to smooth it. Yeah, I know, I'm thinking that. Um, but I think it's called like the Karazi jungle or something like that. And it's, it's supposed to be <laughs> I mean, kind of getting something there. Crazy. Something yeah. Karazi. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Ooh, I oh, I think we did that. So. I think it was a big line of um, Shit. mountains, and since it's RuneScape, they're all in a line. But I don't know. There's a way of... It blocks them all off, and there's a, ch a quest. I was going to say a chest, then. There's a quest to get through. But I thought, instead of that, let's build, like... You jump along the trees. That are, they go low down here. And you just get along so the trees. you can just climb through. Sweet. Yeah. And also, as well, another thing to note is with these jungle trees here, um, these blocks, they, they're actually textured like this on all six faces. And what it is, it is um, this block here... I believe this one is 17 coal on 12, and then the jungle ones are 17 coal on 15, and they basically just have the wood texture on all six. And just, it looks more complete, I'd say. It looks like it's got bark all over yeah, it, like it, it would. Good. It makes more sense, it looks nicer. So I'm probably going to use those for bases of trees. Other than that, this bit here, we just... There's nothing down here on the map as far as we're aware. So rather than just like scatter trees like we did with the rest of Karamja, we densely pack them in here. And it looks pretty cool. And I think this this yeah. mountain here, we should put like lava coming out of it. Not into the jungle, that'd be a disaster. But Well, we'll have to see what it looks in game. We still want to keep it to RuneScape and then our own take on it. Well, yeah, I'd true, say but... at this point we need... But the members area and how we'll... and what we need to do to get here is going to be really hard to build, yeah. personally. But, but, you know, we have what we're going to do is we're going to almost map down the entire world and then build the buildings on it because yeah, it feels because more complete if there's land on it. It's also it just, it's been, just better, isn't it? It's more yeah, while we've been revamping as well, we've noticed that when we have to do the land, we have to basically get rid of the buildings first. That's why all the buildings are floating yeah. in Alcrid for so long. So it's easier to build the land first, then build the buildings on top of rather than part of it at the same time. So. Yeah, That's it, what was, done here. it was Matt in the first place that said with Alcarid. I think, well, actually, yeah, it was Alcarid where he just said, just throw everything in the air, for God's yeah. sake, and then we'll go for <laughs> Getting there. in the way, because you can't vox anything. It's worked out so much better. So don't have the buildings, do the rest of it first. And since Karamja was an island, it just we thought it made more sense to do it all at once. Indeed. <laughs> you know. And also as well, they, I keep thinking that since it clears, since the trees start here, this feels sort of like the end of the islands, but let's, I just want to clarify that. Because I've not been this way before, so Joy, yeah, yeah, you're there. So if you follow me, George, this place yeah, looks yeah. pretty nice as well, because it's all like a crossroads of rivers, and it's all sandy and stuff, and this place looks amazing. This place feels like an RPG, and I didn't think we'd get that sort of epicness feel in RuneCraft, because it's RuneCraft. Well, it's because it's the members area, and RuneScape, as the Jagex put more uh, effort into um, the members area. Yeah. And also, because the members area is bigger, we can achieve more in in minecraft with it with the with the free to play also we started off this would be what the normal world looked like if we yeah. actually started like this if we actually knew how to build when we started the project then a yeah. year ago i know a it was amazing it's amazing how much we changed i know but anyway is that is that all of the world the land shown that we've done so far? that is all of it yeah i mean there is a bit more up here this is where the port's going to be but it's just more rolling hills there's not much else to show and since there was no nothing much on this island I've added in like there's two pools on this like because there's three islands of yeah on this one there's one here which is a circular one and then there's one over here I think somewhere a bit further up it won't That's affect it. how it's played but people 
people wouldn't you don't play minecraft the same as you do uh yeah. runescape anyway because so you can go anywhere you want that, yeah so it doesn't matter that that pool isn't there on you know runescape and it makes it look better if there's yeah. water about and it feels like so is that pretty much it for the video that is pretty much it it does feel like that. Pretty sweet. So, yeah, so this is one of my favourite places in the game. Now, I've said that for every single video revamp, but to be honest, I think every time we think of a new a new like design or a building design, or in this case, a terraforming design, I th we do get better, and I do prefer the new things that we build. Although I would still say Alcarid's still my favourite place, I think. But this place is pretty damn nice. But other than that, that's it for this video. So have you got anything else to say, George? <laughs> and we'll see you in the next video, guys. <laughs>